This home video countdown includes any film that was taken by someone other than a storm chaser. A few look like they're tornado chase videos, but that was not the original intent of the photographer when he or she left home. It's still going that way. Yeah. He's not home yet. Watch it. It's going to get that house right there. Yes, it is. There it is. There went the hot barn. Look at that. Oh, my God. Look. Right You're yeah, kidding. Look at this. Yes, it is. There went the hot barn. Look at that. Oh, my God. Look. Right there. Yeah, Look kidding. It's Look at this. Now. Where's the other one, John? I don't know. You guys still watching? This call. Look at the debris. See the other one? You said you saw two? Yeah, it's already gone ahead. It already went ahead? Yeah. Look at that. It's going to get that new house sitting over there, too. Yeah, there's a brand new house sitting over in that woods. They must have made it past it, though.
Look at that up there. Damn, look at all this wood here. Big time out. Don't get too close, John. Honey, don't worry. We're not, okay? Yeah, we're, we're, we're okay here. It's still a hit. Look at it. It's still a hit. It's going to be big time. Yeah. Well, I can't believe yeah. that little tiny storm cell turned into a... Yeah, yeah, we know. <laughs> wow. Look at Atlanta Lakes here. Tore it up. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. It's brand new building. Look at it. It's getting Brian's house mean? right now. There's Brian's house just went. Why? How do you know it's, it's Brian's or? I know. I can see. Trust me. Boy, it's just south of your folks' house, huh? Come it's come through. Down? Come through right here.
that is moving at a speed of about 20 kilometers an hour. Well, this puppy here is a hydraulic cylinder off a front end loader, high lift front end loader, <laughs> and it's approximately from the edge of the house of debris, it's about, I'd say, about 600 yards that it proved by itself. But one is possibly buried in the ground about five feet, five to six feet into the ground. Look at this, Edward. Get ready for a go to the basement. God, look at it. That's a big one. Dad, get down to the basement. Now. James, run upstairs and grab some blankets. Whoa! Major footage. I don't know how much longer I want to stay here and film. Everything's flying away. Everything. Here comes the wind. She's in her basement. Rich Texas, 
we saw multiple tornadoes. Lightning strike the photographer, then a close-up view of disintegrating trailers. Uh, you can see it coming over the lake now. It's just shooting. It's just totally shooting. Oh, look at the trees by the highway. Bending. All right, look at there. Look at, look at the highway trees. Oh, oh. The power line just went out. Power, power line just went out. Look at them. Oh. Oh. The power lines. I'm getting every power line out. This is cool. <laughs> Shit's gonna Here it happen. comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. <laughs> here it comes. <laughs> it's right out here. Get out of here. 10 That's feet from it, one. and all the electricity, all the power lines are going. Here it is. Okay. Here it is. It's going right out across. You can right see the across, stuff flying. Across, right across. You can see the stuff flying. What's, what bay is it? Look at this. Look at it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You can see it. You can see it for yourself. You can see it. It is totally incredible. This is so sweet. Don't stand by the windows. Totally incredible. It's right outside. Oh, there goes Bob's boat. <laughs> well, I hope not. Whoa, look at that. Okay. Get away from the windows. Whoa. Get away from the windows. Tree just blew over. Bob, look at that tree over. Just look at the top. Get away from the windows. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. Where's everybody? Where's everybody? Where's everybody? It's devastating. It's just totally shot. Why is it killing Jim Danny's house? I'm right here with Carl Puddles. I'm right here with him, 100 yards front, Debbie. Where are you at? Get everybody inside. Yeah. This is one big. Okay, I'm on 60. I'm going to try to shut off everything coming in. It's a uh, quarter mile north of the railroad tracks, a half mile west of Price Road. Okay, it's kind of stationary right now at this time. It is uh, moving to the north, east, mainly east, very fast. It's stationary right now. This is spectacular. This is spectacular. We have to breathe thousands of feet in the air. There are flash fires on all the uh, high tension wires. We're about three quarters of a mile from the actual touchdown at this time. With its vortex breakdown, helical vortices, single suction vortex structure, and 30-foot trees ripped out of the ground, many people consider this view of a tornado to be the best ever taken. Go, shoot it. Better floor it. Better floor it. Shoot it. We're all right. Just stay ahead of it. You're okay. You're okay. Keep going, man. Keep going. For sheer human drama. This may be number one for a long time to come. 
Get up under here. Under here. Under here. Get up under the girders. Is that where you want to go? Yes. Underneath the girders. Keep rolling, Ted. It's coming at us. Tornado is now in the wheat field. Okay, the main tornado is just to our northeast. It's submerged. Uh, we're going to send telemetry. Also, we have other tornadoes revolving around it now. I don't know whether they're anticyclonic or not. Here's our telemetry. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. Okay. Look at the vault on this thing. The tail. Lowering right there. We're gonna have to keep an eye on all this. We have a tornado. Tornado is on the ground there. Okay, on the tripod too. Camera. Really turning up now. Really going good. Yes, go, 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 oh, love those vortices. Over here flying down, it's coming in, we got northwest winds. Oh, it's getting cold and wet. Cold and wet. Sighting of tornado. Sighting of the tornado. Got it. Up close and personal. Tornado's 
still there. Oh, look at that. Okay, you got it? Yeah. I'll tell me to take the pictures. Do you have the signal? Oh, what a classic. This is what's happening just to my west. I'm southbound. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. I'm getting in an area of danger here. Unbelievable. OK, that's an area of uh, outflow going down and up. And here in the center, we have a developing, apparently a developing tornado. Good road RR and 15, tornado on the ground. Goodland does have a tornado warning out on this. This is their area of responsibility. Oh, look at that inflow. My God, it spun up another one right by it. Tornado is still on the ground. Still appears to be drifting slightly southwest. Almost not moving now. The area of rotation is just crossing uh, Highway 36. car just drove through the area of rotation. N0 AM, we got a tornado on the ground. There's uh, people driving through the edge of circulation on the on the road on 36. Uh, tornado on the ground, just south of road Highway 36, west of St. Francis. Do you copy? Once again, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning for a portion of northwest Kansas. Information and details concerning the warned area will be broadcast shortly. 5 LTM Mobile. Okay, we're at the junction of 35 and 82. We're northbound on 35. We have a funnel just off to the west of that junction. Let me ask you a quick question. Are we all seeing the same funnels or are these different funnels? Just Affirmative. All seeing the same storm. Affirmative. Tornado. Okay. Tornado on the ground. Tornado on the ground. Transmission short. Okay. 
Tornado has just crossed 371. Power flashes. It's across the road right in front of us. Got a new wall cloud to the northeast. New developing wall cloud. Okay, we're near the county road oh, 131. This. County Fire. road 131. It's in a house. It's thrown the car. It's thrown the car around. Look at the power flashes. It's hit a transformer. My goodness. Tremendous. Transformers are on fire right here by us. By the Callsburg Cemetery. Callsburg Cemetery. Oh, it's about the Callsburg Cemetery. Uh oh. Weather watching. Which way? Good, we're going south, huh? Well, we're just teasing fate here. Okay, okay now be real careful, Neil. Slow it down. This would be where we drive right into the tornado, so be very, very careful. CG. Rapid circulation right overhead. Slow down, Neil. Stop. Rapid circulation. About one half debris, debris, tornado passing right in front of us. White tornado now. Got to watch for debris. Morgan, yeah. I'm calling you on the PVT. Morgan. You see it? It's going to extend it. Give me the I know. Give me the deal. That's huge. Oh, my God, Mike. It's still Gigantic. on the ground. It's just like sitting there, spinning. I've got northeast winds at 70 miles an hour now. Put it on tripod. Get the other ones all the way down. Hurry, fast. Fast. i got to get it on tripod. Hey, what town is this, Mike? How do I get my... It's hitting the way you're getting the liberal. Where's, where's Hugenson? Where's Hugenson? Almost the right way. Let's go. Straight, straight north? Yeah, it's... Okay, Morgan? Seven miles. It's seven miles north of here, Shukaton? Yeah, Okay. nine mile also. That's okay. You there? Yeah. Okay. Do you want a PVT or video? I'm trying to do... Miles, you say that. So okay, okay, hang on, hang on. I'm going to blast west. Here's the road. I'm going to blast west. Want to blast yeah, west? Go, yeah, let's go. Let's let it go right in front of us. It's real right close. Let's see how close we can get. There's no, there's no stretch here, so we shouldn't be having any much debris problem. Let's get real close to it. This is yeah. Petrowski. I got video okay. of it going right in front of me. Just stand by. I got another PBT. You're shooting video. Yes. Testing phone line. Continue to shoot. Continue to shoot video. Just yes. watch the video. Oh, yeah, I got it. Make sure it's steady and perfect. I got it. Look at it. It's just growing. Morgan, it's now almost a half to three quarters of a mile wide. It's moving right toward the town of Yukonton, four miles south of Yukonton. It's going to hit Yukonton, Kansas, right on the border. Yukonton, Kansas, it's right in front of me. It's a, it's a half a mile to three quarters of a mile wide. It's now larger. It's now larger than Billings. It's now heading toward the town of Yukonton. Yes, it's, it's yeah, well, it's like four miles south, moving right toward him. It's speeding up. I'm going west, right toward it. Yes. Very carefully. Yes. About four, three miles north, there is a town called Wood. That's my Kansas map. Down. That's my. Hang on, hang on. I lost my Kansas map. Three miles north. Go ahead. <laughs> if I go east, I'll get out of the rain. I'm gonna go okay. east to get out of the rain. Okay. All right, Eddie, in there. Keep filming, buddy. Yeah, keep filming. It. Just keep I filming. Ah, uh, Eddie, you there? Got it. Yes. Yes. Can you believe that motion? I bet it's tremendous motion. Even this. Beautiful. My God, that's beautiful. Watch out for debris. Here. Yep. Be okay. You're right. We're coming behind Look you. Look at that. Shut your door for just a second.
got audio going? Okay, right down the road, right there, is Laverne. Not too close, not too close. Okay, no problem. You just hang in here with me, okay? Don't hang up the phone on me. Laverne is gonna get nailed. Laverne's gonna get hit. Warn Laverne. Tell those people to get down. This is big time. But watch out for strong info. Unbelievable. Yep. Okay, Great. we copy. East side. I'd like to do time lapse on something like this. Very nice, very nice tornado, very nice. Picture at 715, wide angle. Very nice. Wide open, 120. 718. 718. 718. Rope tornado. Rope tornado. Yes. Yes. There goes Mr. Funnel. Here comes a shooting vortex. Sub vortex down. Instantaneous tornado. Time is 725. We have sub vortices. It's on the ground. Look at the churning on the other side of the lake. Look at the churning on the other side of the lake. It's just across the, the bridge from us. Take some great photos. These people are crazy to go forward. Look at that motion of the base. All right, we've got a funnel down to the southeast. This storm is going crazy. Tornado Southeast, number five. Number four, rather. Number four, Tornado Southeast. All right, Tornado Southeast and Tornado East. We have two tornadoes on the ground simultaneously. Tornado number three, roping out. Oh, yes! Just what makes a storm like this go mad? Number eight. The tornado number eight. Tornado number eight is on the ground and rotating around the backside. All right, funnel, funnel cloud, funnel cloud. Okay, big tornado. All right, it's cleared away from it. Yes, yes, yes. Lightning in it. That'll help. Thank you. <laughs> yes, definitely, yes.
the video, I'm a mile south of an F4 tornado, John. We're going to follow it. We're going to follow it up towards Ponca City. Uh, I'll call you back. We're going to get out and shoot some video. Why not? Yeah. Getting audio? Yeah. You are? Yeah. This is an unbelievable sight. It looks like an F4 tornado. It's just about a mile north of us. We're actually out of danger, believe it or not. I'm going to get back in the vehicle. Somebody check the. Uh Chopper 2 up now. Greg? It's got to be a half mile. mile, mile it's got to be a half mile wide. It's about a quarter of a mile wide. It was like hey, man got, all over we, again. We have got to get a chopper up, man. This is incredible. It's still on the ground. It's been on the ground for almost an hour now. Something about you gets 
All right, uh, what we've got is the, the little round dish is a satellite dish, and we send text messages back, to, back and forth from the lab on that. Uh, they'll send us OBS, and uh, we'll send back where we are. We don't use it a whole lot. We use the cell phone a lot more now than we used to, but we have the two antennas up front are for the two different cellular phones. The big, tall antenna is for our VHF FM uh, radios. If we're parked and we need better coverage, we just swing it up in the air and uh, use it. And then that antenna up there is one of the VHF radios, and there's another one at the back for VHF. The, the thing sticking up right in the middle is a flux gate compass to tell us what direction the vehicle's pointing all the time. And then on the front, you've, you've probably seen these on all the cars. Um, 
This thing is a pressure port, and it's got a clear hose that goes back into the back of the van and t hooks up to a barometer, a uh, digital barometer. We use this to take the, all the wind gusts and all those sorts of pressure effects out and just leave us with the, the air pressure that you would see if the van wasn't moving and if there weren't wind gusts and all that. That's what this accomplishes. Uh, R.M. Young, uh, uh, what do they call those? Uh, yeah, it's a, the, the, the propeller is the anemometer and then the whole thing measures direction. Uh, there's a special name for a system like that. I don't remember what it is, though. Uh, what else? Then the, uh, the curved thing over there contains two thermometers and a uh, hygrometer. So we get, our, we get our temperature and our humidity and our water vapor content uh, from the instruments in that shield. It has a fan in it that sucks air through it all day long. Uh, so when we're sitting still, we get good measurements. When we're moving down the road, the way it's designed is it, ought, it just, it's designed so that air gets sucked through it because of the pressure effects on it. In fact, we, uh, we have a, a GPS receiver that tells us our, our vehicle heading and speed all the time. So we get that, our vehicle motion vector, and then we get a wind vector off of this, and you just subtract those two vectors, and, it le and what it leaves you with is regular wind. So it's with the, accurate within about a meter per second driving down the highway. None of us expected that to work that well. It just it just did, so we're really happy.